This last week was a dumpster fire. Hello, my name is Amy, and thank you very much for watching. So, I didn't do anything hobby related last week. I live in downtown DC, and things were pretty much touch and go. I was watching the live streams of the protests, which are totally valid, and I was on the side of the protesters, but I'm also very concerned about the rioting and the looting because there were instances of cars being on fire and exploding, buildings were on fire, and if buildings are on fire and it got out of control, I live in the middle of it and therefore I would be in mortal danger. So, I was a little distracted by that. That being said, this last week was not about me. It was about the peaceful protesters. And I know that I don't have a huge audience, but I would like to share some clips of some of, of the speeches that I listened to early on in the protests. Because a big business has different locations all over the country, all over the world. There's a McDonald's or a Starbucks on every corner of every street in every country. Yeah. What places we hidden? My cousin's a manager. My cousin is a black general manager of a bar in D.C. What happens if his place gets, lo gets destroyed tonight? Then I'm going to get up and I'm going to help him rebuild it. Because that's what we do. But this not the message. This not what we here for. I got shot with tear gas. I got hit with flashbangs like it's fucking Call of Duty. Like it's Call of Duty. They went shooting him in the crowd. It was eight of us standing there, not even standing together, and they aimed at us individually and shot at us. That's why this is happening. That's why people are reacting like this has been peaceful all day. It's been peaceful all day, and they're aiming at us and shooting at us like we're criminals. I have a master's degree. I have a master's degree in psychology. And I peacefully protested and got shot with tear gas and flashbangs. That's why this is going on. Don't let nobody say it's better.
Tricks, huh? I want y'all to value my life the same way I value my life. 